Previously on Beer and Board Games. The offensive band name generator game. Inanimate objects. Granola journey. Ugly potty. It's Japanese burrito ass bags. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Beer and Board Games, folks, where I'm not quite feeling myself today. Come and bend genders with us as we play the gender bending game, Gender Benders. Some of us are going to explore our feminine sides. I am exploring my feminine side right now. I don't see this as my feminine side. I see this as my true side. How about some beer? Few Harvey! He looks like Justine Bateman. Justine Bateman is not blonde. She's dark-headed. Yeah. Yeah. Then if someone's blonde, do you call them light-headed? Depends on which blonde we're talking about. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. No, you're, you're women now. You don't do that. Oh, yeah. depends on which blonde we're talking about. <laughs> Tonight we are drinking a special beer from Lakefront Brewery, Oktoberfest Lager. It's not too hoppy, it's not too sweet, but it's solid and kind of neat. It has a really subtle, like, caramely flavor. Does anybody else get that? Yeah. Ricky Davis. Happy fucking birthday, you slice of shit! Oh no, Ricky <laughs> Davis! This uh, whole show is dedicated to you, my friend. Members of the Cactopia Forum have bought out the next two shows in your honor. And the Cactopia Forum is watching right now on the live stream, and they're having a little birthday party for Ricky C Cactus Man. Have we mentioned that you can go to subbable.com slash beer and board games and purchase perks and rewards for the show? You can have a game piece named after you. Our birthday buddy, Ricky the Cactus Boy, did just that. We are going to call all of the cards in this game Ricky's. We have here a little reminder of Ricky's status as the king of cacti. Isn't that cute? That's a cute cactus. <clears throat> it looks like an ulcer. When Ricky turns 45, he will be the Ulcer King. <laughs> if he's had a stressful life. You got that to look forward to, Ricky! Yeah. The point of this game is to test whether you can think as the opposite gender would by answering a series of questions. So you need to put yourself in the sex. In the, the body of a woman? Right. In, right in the butthole. I put, my, <laughs> I put myself... Bitch. Yeah. All right, let's play the game of gender benders, guys. Are you excited? Yeah! yeah. Karen goes first. She is going to draw a Ricky that is of her opposite gender, a blue Ricky, which is what happens when Ricky becomes sexually frustrated. And she's going to read the question aloud. The men at the table are going to pick which of the choices they think is most like a choice that they would make as a man. Exactly. So what is your man's name? Kevin. I want my name to be Pumpkin. I'll be um, Nancy. Craig. Corinthia. Your parents were obnoxious. Yeah. I know. <laughs> we're ready to, to answer the first question. Let's see what that Ricky has to say. When you get together with the guys after work, the most common topic of conversation is A, work, B, sports, C, women. Kevin, real yours. And the rest of us said... Oh, two more A's. Oh. The trick with that one is that you guys like your jobs. <laughs> it's time for Pumpkin to yeah. draw a pink Ricky. Suppose you were a woman. What do you collect the most of? A, men. <laughs> B, twist ties. Or C, <laughs> dust? What the is hell? The... This is just condescending and stupid. I agree with you. This game is from 1988. Pumpkin... Yeah. I thought that you collect twist ties. Pumpkin is right. Yes! What? Why the fuck would twist ties be on? I don't it doesn't make any fucking it's sense! It's Let's toast Risky. Let's toast the sponsor of this show. You just called him Risky. Risky, Risky Business. Now that's a nickname, Ricky. Yes! They call me Risky. Or they could call you Rick. Risky! Risky! Yay. Yeah, cactus buddy! Ricky is the cactus king. We don't know why. I just feel like a really ugly woman right now. You're beautiful. No, you I don't. Stop putting yourself You're down. You're beautiful inside. No, stop. You've got too much forehead going on. Maybe that'll... Is yeah. that better? No, 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 no. No, women look, always have no, their hair all the way no, down to their just, eyebrows. There. There you go. Hello, boys. <laughs> I'm here for my lunch. Uh -huh. <laughs> lunch lady. <laughs> oh, no. You're supposed to serve me lunch. <laughs> Can we change this up somehow? But I'm winning. Can we act these scenarios out instead oh, of answering yeah. them? Oh, yeah. There you go. That's good. 
Suppose you were a man. Your wife keeps asking you to do something you think is too kinky. What do you do? A. Refuse to discuss it. B. Do it to please her. C. Do it, but do it wrong. Well, what answer? Oh, do, do it, it to please her. Do it, but do it wrong. These are my girlfriends. Hi. Hi, Hello. this is Kevin, my husband. This is Nancy, and this is Pumpkin. Pumpkin. We would like to have all sex with you. Oh, Corinthia, <laughs> you know how long I've wanted this. I know. I've been in the mood for all sex all week. I know, I can't believe he's going to do it. And he's gonna do it right. All right, zip. Ba-doom, ba-doom, doom. Ba-doom, ba-doom, doom. Ba-doom, ba-doom, doom. Oh, he's doing it wrong. Oh, come on, you're supposed to... I swear he can I'm do sorry, it! I'm sorry, your breasts are so large, they were frightening. <laughs> come on. Get... I'm going to the bar to try and get picked up, which is option number C, and it's what I'm going to do. Goodbye. I'm going home to collect twist ties. <laughs> I'm never letting you touch me again. Oh, Corinthia! Kevin, I can't say mad at you. Let's have two sex. Okay. <laughs> One point. That works for me. <laughs> <laughs> what goes on last? Eyeshadow, lipstick, or blusher? What the fuck is a blusher? It's... I guess we'll it's find blush. out. But it used to be called blusher. No fucking way. Blusher? I, yeah. I watch TV. Yeah. I never heard that term. There were a lot of makeup ads back then. I would put lipstick on last, because I might want to, you know, force in some, like, biscuits or candy or something. <clears throat> Act it out. Go. Welcome to Sears. Might I interest you in some makeup? Would you care for a biscuit? Oh, yes, thank you. Luckily, I haven't put my lipstick on yet. <laughs> so what kind of biscuit was that? <laughs> a lipstick biscuit? <laughs> you look wonderful. What? It that... goes with your blusher. Oh, Kevin, you get out of here. You go back to sporting goods. I don't know anything about makeup. <laughs> well, now I need to wax my biscuit down there, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. Do you have any food that I can put? <laughs> uh, we, ha we have some candy. <laughs> Oh, great. Waxing candy? Ah! That's oh, caramel. Yeah, that's good. Thank you. Thanks for coming to Sears. <laughs> One point. It's Nancy's turn. And Nancy wants to get nasty. With the pink Ricky. Suppose you were a woman. The gossip at the office has you pegged as easy. <gasps> what do you do? A, set the record straight. B, look for another job. C, Laugh it off. Well, at least this one has her working. Hey, Nancy. Hey, Carpathia. It's Corinthia. Sorry. But I heard some awesome office gossip. Awesome office gossip? Awesome <laughs> office gossip. I hear that you're S-L-U-U-T. A slut? That's right. <laughs> slut. I'm shaming you. I'm slut shaming. That wasn't laughing it off. That hurt. <laughs> Now I'm laughing, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> One point. All right. I think we all learned a little lesson there, too. Your husband won't get rid of the dangerous pile of junk in the backyard. No explanation. <laughs> it's a pile of heroin. <laughs> what do you do? A, hire someone. B, keep after him. C, plant flowers on it. I'm going to keep after him until he does it. I would hire someone, but I want him to buy me stuff. I need to discuss something with you. If you're gonna go at me about the broken glass in the backyard again, I don't want to hear about it. Well, not the broken glass this time. It's all the stuff on top of the broken oh, glass. Oh, for Christ's sake, Corinthia! The I work all day! Yeah, but you don't work on the weekends, and that's what the weekends are for. The weekends are for something else besides work, Corinthia. What? Who's at the door? Can I go open the door? Talk to us through the door! Okay, is it never Nancy? Hey, Nancy! Green! Oh, hi. <laughs> Say, that pile of unsightly items in your yard? Yes. My boy, Trevor, just fell into it, and he hasn't come out of it yet. I know. I'm a little worried. Let's... Let the boy have fun! Stop don't... coddling him! Listen, Kevin, don't you snap at me. Listen, you're turning him into a girl, okay? <laughs> Don't mess with Nancy, she slaps. I've heard you're a slut. I'm a slut, <laughs> and you know it, damn it. Kevin, can you come back to bed, please? These need a massage. I'm taking away pumpkin until you clean the yard. I'll clean the yard for you, pumpkin. Do you want me to help? Yes, I do. Just like that. I've left the scene. <laughs> Your buddies are getting into skydiving. Ska dancing? Will you shut <laughs> up? A message to you, Rudy. A message to you. Your buddies 
are getting into skydiving. Oh. Sky spurling? <laughs> <laughs> You're afraid of heights. When they ask you to come along, what do you tell them? A. I've got a bad back. B. I'm too busy wrestling alligators. C. Why would anyone want to jump out of a perfectly good airplane? You gotta say the alligators. Hey Kevin, we're going out for a dive this weekend. It's about time you join us. Skydiving! Nancy Man, I got That's my name, Nancy Man. I'm busy. What are you busy doing? Wrestling gators. Ah, Shut the fuck up. I am. You asshole. What do you think I keep in the pile of junk in the backyard? Jesus mm -hmm. Christ, there's gators back there? There is. Oh my is. God, let's do that instead. Yeah. I want to see these gators right now. Take us to the pile of junk. <laughs> <laughs> there's a dead child in here. <laughs> Holy shit. I got tetanus. Kevin, can you come back to bed? <laughs> when a woman has big bosoms, she just does this all the time. Do. They do, they hold them up. We're now going to celebrate Ricky with an insult. You live in arid climates. You are a saguaro. And you hoard water like an asshole and you won't give it to anyone. Ricky, sh just shut the hell up. No one wants to hear from you or talk to you or look at you, Cactus King. There's a cover of a whole album. You look like that too. You want to yeah. be the girl with the That's most cake. I am doll parts, doll skin, <laughs> doll farts. Suppose I was a woman. I discover that a male coworker whose company I enjoy is gay. You seem like a nice man. Why aren't you married? Oh, honey, you don't want to know why I'm not married. Oh, no, I do because I'm very inquisitive. You've got to learn how to accessorize. Wait a minute. You're doing all the telltale signs of homosexuality. I'm gay. Hey, Kevin, are you ready to go? <laughs> Who's this? It's, it's me, a male lover. Oh, you're here too. Yes. <laughs> so, you read the question. Yes. And then we try to guess what A, B, and C are gonna be. Okay, Dennis Hopper. And we'll fuck anything that moves! Wait a minute. Paps Blue Ribbon! As your 18-year-old niece walks by out of earshot, your construction buddies make suggestive remarks. What do you do? Join them. You tell them to shut up. Fire them all because if I was a man and a construction worker, I would be foreman and I would have this power. You guessed A would be join them and it is join in. Voila, 1988, bitch. Matt, you, did, you didn't get B right, but that was C. Tell them to knock it off. The third one is clam up. Clam! <laughs> Clam up. Who would ever answer that? I know. Clam up. I'd just clam up right there. I would snap my mollusk face. I would, I'd be a bivalve. I would live at the bottom of the sea and uh, eventually be the victim of a bake. <laughs> Folks, we had a good time playing the Jenner Burners game. Jenner Burners. Barn Burners, Jenner Burner. It's been a good time playing the Jenner Burners game. But now it's time to stop doing it. Kevin, can you come back to bed? <laughs>